Hollywood couple Kurt Russell and Goldie Hawn proved they still have star quality well into their 70s as they impressed holidaymakers on the Greek island of Skiathos on Tuesday, June 20. Russell, now 72, who appeared in such movies as Tombstone, Backdraft, Big Trouble in Little China and The Hateful Eight, zoomed across the glittering waters of the Med in a speedboat to collect his longtime 77-year-old partner from McLady's Beach as holidaymakers looked on in wonder. Juan, who made a name for herself in such films as Private Benjamin, Death Becomes Her and Bird on a Wire, patiently waited on a beach jetty dressed in a polka dot sundress, still looking glamorous despite her advancing years. She was helped on board by a couple of friends, before they all sped off into the distance the pair, who have been together since Valentine's Day 1983, are believed to be regular visitors to the Greek island, located in the Aegean Sea, in the Spirads. House Speaker Kevin McCarthy supports expunging Donald Trump's impeachments despite being together for 40 years, they have chosen not to marry because they like making the constant decision to stay together, and have raised son Wyatt Russell, along with Hunt's children Kate and Oliver Hudson from her previous relationship with musician Bill Hudson. An onlooker from the beach told The Mirror, the scene caused a lot of excitement, but they both seemed relaxed and happy. Seeing them was a lovely end to our holiday on the island. The couple are very popular with the tourists and locals. He continued, I can remember Goldie Hawn's regular appearances in Rowan and Martin's Laugh-In, an American comedy show in the late 60s and early 70s, and my wife and I have both enjoyed her films. I've enjoyed Kurt Russell's performances over the decades. We've even watched their recent Santa Claus film. Don't miss. Harry and Meghan's comeback is achievable as expert pinpoints Sussex revival, latest, the duo initially met when they were working on the one and only, genuine, original family band, which was released way back in 1968. However, they didn't get together immediately, with Han marrying West Side Story's Gus Draconis, who went on to direct episodes of such shows as Baywatch and Quantum Leap, a year later. After that marriage broke down, she then tied the knot with Hudson. Again, there was no happy ever after, with the pair going their separate ways in 1982. Russell, meanwhile, has one failed marriage to his name. He married actress Susan Hubley in 1979, but the pair split four years later in 1983, not long before he got together with Han. They have a son together, Grant Russell.